My name is Darren Canelli. I work for Berkey's Farm Store. I've been a precision farming specialist for about seven years now. And uh, the interesting part about telematics is we do have a, a segment of the industry that is more interested in telematics, especially your larger operations, your fertilizer dealers, your co-ops who are interested in fleet management. Most of our producers' customers that don't have a large volume of equipment are not so interested in telematics now, but I think the point at which they will become interested when we start to really push in the reduced downtime during the off-season. And I think where that really comes into play is off-site diagnostics. So if a guy goes down, if he's able to make a telephone call and somebody that's miles away can access that monitor and try to find out what the problem is so that he can keep going sooner, I think that's where a lot of guys are going to see the value in telematics. At this point, um, we don't really see that value as much or the customers haven't even realized that. But I think as time goes on, they're going to start realizing the value of that piece of the puzzle more than just a fleet management like a lot of customers or co-ops are seeing now. I think it's just selling the value. I think a lot of guys now when they think of telematics, they think that they'll be able to download their information from their tractor to their home. Uh, wirelessly and they're interested in that but yeah they don't see a great value in that because they can take their card or, or transfer it um, in many other ways so they don't see a great value in that and I don't think a lot of them have really seen that value that can come from reduced downtime so I think from a dealership perspective we need to be selling that value in order to see to be able to have them convinced of what that value could bring to them in telematics. I think where we're seeing right now is some of the more productive producers, more some of the more advanced producers are starting to be interested in this and they will be the early adopters we'll probably jump into and I always say the proof is in the pudding and so when you get more and more people that are starting to do this they're going to see the value themselves and they're going to start promoting it to the, the different friends and the uh, neighbor farmers that they do have and then from a dealer perspective if we continue to push that it'll continue to grow.